is up guys i just got a delivery there's something wrong with me in the sense that i have developed an obsession with finding the perfect vegan protein powder so if you guys watched my recent vegan protein review it was on the alani new vegan plant-based protein in the fruity cereal so i'll leave that link down below in case you guys are also trying to find the perfect protein for you with your fitness and health goals so i actually placed my order and bought two different proteins not sponsored from blessed you guys actually recommended blessed to me in that last protein video and i've seen a lot of the ads on my instagram just by scrolling by and i really love katia i really like her personality her body is popping so from my understanding she was the one that sort of created this plant-based protein i saw that they just came out with a new flavor which is strawberry milk and then i also saw that they had a limited edition birthday cake or something along that lines and i really wasn't fond of the other flavors that they already had so i thought this would be the perfect time for me to finally try it out so i actually bought these at different times of the same day which is why they shipped in different boxes so i got the small size this is a really tiny package this one has 23 grams of plant-based protein and this small container has 15 servings in it so this one is the strawberry milk and it's gluten-free vegan friendly zero sugar non-gmo and of course dairy free so really excited to taste test this one Ooh, now this one is the 30 servings so i do think that it's expensive especially when you're trying out a new protein brand for the first time you know you don't really know if it's going to be good is it going to be worth it supplements cost a lot especially being that this is really 30 days worth of your protein if you have one every single day so this is the limited edition birthday cake and this one sold out so fast so i was really lucky to get my hands on it and again gluten-free vegan friendly zero sugar non-gmo dairy free and if you guys are wondering what is the source of protein since it is a vegan base and it has raw activated pea protein so it should be pretty easy on your digestion since it is activated so the ingredients list doesn't look to be too long zero grams of sugar though so that's pretty interesting it does have oh spirulina extract turmeric it has some rock salt natural sweeteners which would include stevia and that's the thing with me if you watch my last protein review a lot of these plant-based protein brands do use stevia to sweeten it which is good zero calories but i feel like a lot of the times by doing that it almost takes over the profile of the flavors and all i really can focus on is the stevia and i'm personally not the biggest stevia fan so i'm really interested to see if this lives up to the hype this is literally all i see on my youtube channel from all of the blessed girls that i'm subscribed to and i think i spent like a hundred dollars on this guys so it better be delicious that's all i'm saying so i'm gonna go get some almond milk to mix this up and it says give your body the taste buds and the quality that it deserves love that for us not all plant proteins are created equal and you deserve only the best okay that's a really big statement to claim our premium quality plant-based protein has been procured from the purest source of activated golden shelled pea isolate from Canada, 100% raw sustainable ingredients, 100% recycled packaging, 100% smooth, creamy, and delicious. That's what I'm about to taste test for a second to see if that's true. And it says that it has zero additives. So that's a lot of claims. Not only is it what's in the protein, but it's also what isn't in the protein. Very true. Love that. That makes blessed the best. They're really hyping themselves up. There aren't any nasties, zero artificial additives, sweeteners, grit or digestive enzymes 100 sustainable raw ingredients wow so i'm not vegan by any means i do however live a dairy-free lifestyle for those of you guys that are new so i'm a huge fan of plant-based proteins and i don't feel like you need to be a vegan to buy a plant-based protein to switch from your traditional way i just feel like it's lighter on your digestion i know for me before i transitioned into a dairy-free lifestyle i was 
playing around with ways and different brands and it just made me feel extremely bloated. My stomach was very gurgly. I felt like I had cramping and it was only when I had the protein. So I feel like switching to a vegan plant-based pea protein would be a really great thing for you to do if you're looking for some supplements during your fitness and health journey. This is what I always use with my protein shakes. I do use the vanilla and yeah, it's great. I love it. So let's try the strawberry milk first. I think I'm so excited. I wish I got this one in the big tub. I believe this one is a part of their standard collection. I also love the packaging, how pink it is. It's just very girly and different than the other flavors like chocolate coconut, vanilla chai, and salted caramel. Ooh, this one smells really good. I'm gonna do like half a scoop because I'm gonna taste the bowl. I feel like finding the right supplements is the hardest part of a fitness journey because there's just so many out there and everyone's always recommending different things and new ones are popping up. Works pretty well. So I'm gonna put that, ooh, definitely getting it all over the place. I'm gonna pour it in here. Ooh, it's a little bit pink. Yeah, very smooth from what I can see. the bottom of the protein. That's what the funfetti was looking like in the jar. You can kind of see the specs of what I think is funfetti. So we'll see how that one tastes. So I've made both protein shakes. This one is the birthday cake. And then of course this one is the strawberry milk. You can see this one's slightly pink. I did throw ice cube in here because I like my proteins to be cold. You can see they don't really fill it up all the way to the top. You know, that's kind of weird. Like I feel like the amount that's in here could easily fill this up to the top. But that's very interesting. So let's get this taste test started. Got strawberry milk. It smells like strawberry ice cream, like an actual strawberry milkshake. Okay guys. Wow, I don't taste any stevia at all. It's very smooth and blended perfectly with that almond milk. Like I said, I use it for all my protein shakes. It is the best combination it just adds a little bit of flavor something extra i can't do a protein with just water it just doesn't taste good to me i like a creamier smooth light protein this is really good i taste strawberry right off the bat there's no weird artificial anything because there is none in the product and i have to say i don't know like i've tried so many vegan plant-based proteins right that is definitely top of my list. Oh, okay, I'm excited now for birthday cake. So we've got this one, limited edition. Again, I chilled it with an ice cube. Wow, that strawberry is so good. Okay, let's see. Okay, definitely like the strawberry milk better than this. I don't taste any birthday anything. Maybe that's what the specs are supposed to be at the bottom because it doesn't taste like cake to me at all. Not even cake batter. Okay, they definitely missed the mark on this birthday cake. I'll say it tastes like vanilla because there's no flavor to it in my opinion. But let me tell you, the strawberry milk, ooh, this is where it's at. If I could have got this in a 30 servings container, I would. I will definitely be repurchasing this flavor again because it's very smooth. It's not gritty. 
they both blended really well, really quickly, very soft. Um, again, it's not thick, it's not chunky, I don't see any clumps in here. So, I'm gonna rate strawberry milk five out of five stars. This birthday cake is not bad, it just doesn't taste like birthday cake. <laughs> I mean, I'm gonna drink it, but my hopes were up a little bit. Oh my god. See, the strawberry came through. Strawberry milk is where it's at. I guess that's it for my first impression on Blessed. If you were to get anything from here, I'm gonna have to say strawberry milk. By far, I could see myself drinking this multiple times out of the day on its own. I could also throw it in a smoothie with more strawberries to enhance that flavor a little bit more. Um, throw a banana in it, have a strawberry banana milkshake, you know. The birthday cake definitely needs some. Some, some. But, um, yeah. So, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys want more health, fitness, and lifestyle related content, Hit. check out my playlist down below it's like literally full of workouts meal prep ideas what i eat in a day for weight loss exercises all of that fun stuff so i hope that you guys enjoy and i will see you guys in my next video very soon bye